Trump draws 60K at New York rally. Can he win the state? Recently, Donald Trump held an electrifying rally in New York that not only captured the attention of political observers, but also evoked nostalgia for the fervent energy of his 2016 campaign. The event generated an astonishing amount of interest, with reports indicating that over 60,000 people requested tickets to attend. Although the venue could accommodate approximately 19,000 attendees, the overwhelming demand reflects Trump's enduring appeal among his base. This scenario, with many supporters arriving as early as 7 a.m. to secure their spots, highlights the significant enthusiasm and commitment that his followers have towards his campaign. During his speech, Trump delivered a series of powerful messages that resonated deeply with the crowd. He emphasized themes centered around safety, economic prosperity, and a collective desire to restore what he referred to as a better version of America. The culmination of his remarks was marked by his iconic phrase, often modified to fit various contexts, which serves to reinforce his brand and political identity. By skillfully incorporating phrases like make America safe again or make America happy again, he effectively taps into a collective yearning among his supporters for a return to an idealized past. This strategy not only consolidates his base, but also engages potential supporters who are drawn to his vision. The significance of this rally goes beyond mere attendance figures. It raises important questions regarding Trump's viability as a candidate in New York. Historically, New York has leaned heavily Democratic, making a victory for Trump appear improbable at first glance. Yet, the palpable enthusiasm at the rally suggests that he might outperform expectations. Should he lose the state, it could be by a margin considerably smaller than what has been seen in previous elections, potentially under 10 percentage points. Such a development would signify a noteworthy shift in voter sentiment, especially given the long-standing Democratic dominance in the region. Recent polling data adds another layer of complexity to the conversation surrounding Trump's prospects in New York. Some polls indicate that Biden's lead over Trump is narrowing, which runs counter to earlier expectations that suggested a more significant Democratic advantage. If Trump were to replicate or even improve upon his 2020 performance, particularly among key demographic groups, there is a distinct possibility that he could close the gap in a meaningful way. Even if he were to ultimately lose to Vice President Kamala Harris, the enthusiasm and energy from the rally could help him to significantly narrow the margins. This contrasts sharply with the Biden-Harris campaign, which has faced considerable criticism regarding their visibility and engagement with the electorate. Reports have emerged highlighting that the Biden-Harris ticket has conducted an unusually low number of interviews and public appearances, raising concerns about their ability to connect with potential voters. This lack of outreach could be detrimental, particularly as Trump continues to draw massive crowds at his events, effectively showcasing a more dynamic and engaged campaign. The stark difference in the levels of enthusiasm and engagement between the two campaigns could play a pivotal role in shaping voter perceptions leading up to the election. Moreover, the sheer demand for Trump's rallies has led to intriguing speculation about the potential for hosting even larger events in the future. Some supporters have suggested that a rally at a venue like the Bristol Motor Speedway, capable of hosting up to 200,000 people, could set a record for attendance at a political rally in U.S. history. While logistical challenges and security concerns would certainly need to be addressed, the overwhelming interest in Trump's appearances underscores the strength of his grassroots movement and the fervor with which his supporters are rallying around him. While the idea of winning New York outright remains a formidable challenge for Trump, the energy and excitement generated by his rallies could still significantly bolster his overall numbers in the popular vote. Even if he does not secure a victory in the state, the shifting dynamics, especially in suburban and urban areas, could contribute to a closer overall race. As Trump continues to campaign vigorously across the nation, his ability to sustain this level of enthusiasm will be crucial in determining the outcome of the upcoming elections. In addition to the immediate impact of the rally, there are broader implications for the Republican Party as a whole. Trump's ability to draw such large crowds and maintain high levels of enthusiasm may inspire candidates in down-ballot races. If he can harness this energy effectively, it could translate into greater support for Republican candidates in various local and state elections, further solidifying a Republican foothold in areas that may have leaned Democratic in the past. Furthermore, Trump's rally success has the potential to impact voter registration and mobilization efforts. The excitement generated from such events can galvanize supporters to engage in grassroots organizing, helping to increase voter turnout in upcoming elections. In a political climate where every vote matters, the ability to mobilize a dedicated base could prove invaluable in swing districts and states, influencing the overall electoral map. In summary, while the prospect of Trump winning New York may seem unlikely given the state's historical voting patterns, the recent rally has demonstrated a formidable level of support that could reshape the narrative as the election approaches. The challenges faced by the Biden-Harris campaign in engaging with voters further complicate the landscape, potentially opening the door for a more competitive race than previously anticipated. As the political environment continues to evolve, the ramifications of these rallies and the fervent support for Trump will be key factors in determining the outcome of the election. With both parties navigating a complex and rapidly changing political landscape, the coming months will be critical in shaping the future of American politics. The recent rally held by Donald Trump in New York serves as a significant focal point in understanding the current political landscape leading up to the upcoming elections. 
the overwhelming turnout, with over 60,000 requests for tickets and approximately 19,000 enthusiastic attendees, not only underscores Trump's enduring appeal among his base, but also highlights a crucial moment for his campaign. This rally, reminiscent of the energy and fervor seen during the 2016 elections, offers important insights into the potential dynamics of the upcoming electoral battle. Key takeaway one, enthusiasm and engagement. One of the most striking aspects of Trump's New York rally was the palpable enthusiasm of his supporters. Many attendees camped out early, eager to secure their place in what they viewed as a vital expression of political allegiance. This level of engagement is critical, especially as it signals to both political parties the strength of Trump's grassroots support. Such enthusiasm is not just limited to attendance. It often translates into increased voter registration and mobilization efforts, crucial components for any successful campaign. The energy generated by such rallies can invigorate not only Trump supporters, but also influence undecided voters who may be swayed by the collective fervor of the crowd. The stark contrast between Trump's ability to draw large crowds and the relatively muted response to the Biden-Harris campaign highlights a potential vulnerability for the Democrats. If this trend continues, it may shape perceptions of both candidates and ultimately impact voting behavior. Key takeaway two, shifting political dynamics in New York. Historically, New York has been a solidly Democratic stronghold, making Trump's prospects of winning the state appear unlikely. However, the rally's attendance suggests a possible shift in voter sentiment. Recent polling data indicating a narrowing gap between Trump and Biden, coupled with the enthusiasm evident at the rally, could suggest that Trump may not only perform better than expected, but could also set the stage for a closer race. Polling indicates that if Trump can narrow Biden's lead significantly, even if he does not win outright, he could bolster his overall numbers in the popular vote. This would not only be a psychological victory for Trump and his supporters, but could also influence down-ballot races, as increased turnout in traditionally Democratic areas might benefit Republican candidates. Key takeaway three, challenges for the Biden-Harris campaign. The Biden-Harris campaign has faced notable challenges, particularly regarding visibility and engagement with voters. The low number of interviews and public appearances conducted by the ticket raises concerns about their strategy and ability to connect with the electorate. As Trump continues to energize his base, the contrasting approach of the Biden-Harris campaign may become increasingly problematic. The lack of engagement could potentially alienate undecided voters and those who feel disconnected from the Democratic platform. If the Biden-Harris campaign cannot effectively communicate their message or inspire enthusiasm comparable to that of Trump's rallies, they may find it difficult to maintain their advantage in key battleground states. Key takeaway four, the impact of Trump's campaign on the Republican Party. Trump's rally success has broader implications for the Republican Party as a whole. His ability to draw large crowds and maintain high levels of enthusiasm may serve as a rallying point for other Republican candidates running in local and state elections. If Trump can effectively leverage this energy, it could translate into greater support for Republican candidates down the ballot, potentially reversing Democratic gains in areas previously thought to be securely blue. Additionally, as Trump continues to campaign vigorously across the nation, the potential for increased voter turnout among Republicans becomes more pronounced. A motivated base can significantly impact swing districts and states, where every vote can be critical in determining the outcome of the election. Key takeaway five, the role of grassroots mobilization. The excitement surrounding Trump's rallies can act as a catalyst for grassroots organizing efforts. A dedicated base galvanized by high energy events can lead to more robust volunteer efforts, increased voter registration, and ultimately higher turnout. This grassroots mobilization is particularly important in the context of the current political climate, where voter engagement is essential for success. Moreover, as Trump announces plans for additional rallies in other states, such as Ohio and Colorado, the potential for expanding this grassroots movement increases. If his campaign can maintain this momentum, it may enhance his electoral chances and contribute to a more competitive race overall. Key takeaway six, implications for the upcoming election. In summary, Trump's New York rally not only showcases his enduring appeal, but also highlights the complex and evolving dynamics of the upcoming elections. The excitement and enthusiasm generated at such events signal a possible shift in voter sentiment that could have implications for both the Republican and Democratic parties. As the Biden-Harris campaign navigates challenges related to voter engagement, they may need to reassess their strategies to effectively counter Trump's mobilization efforts. The broader political landscape appears to be shifting, with the potential for a more competitive race than previously anticipated. The ramifications of Trump's rallies, the challenges faced by the Biden-Harris campaign, and the impact on the Republican Party all contribute to a multifaceted electoral environment. As the elections draw closer, both parties will need to adapt and respond to these evolving dynamics, making the coming months critical in shaping the future of American politics. Ultimately, while the prospect of Trump winning New York may still seem unlikely given its historical voting patterns, the enthusiasm and energy demonstrated at the rally are crucial indicators of a shifting political climate. As both parties prepare for the upcoming election, the outcomes of these rallies and the evolving voter sentiment will play a vital role in determining the direction of the country.